What's up ladies and gents, guys, this is the last boss on Lords of the Fallen. I chose to do the radiant side of things, guys. Of course, there's three different um, outcomes on the story. One is the umbral secret, the other is the radiance, and the other is the evil. I chose the radiance because I want all three classes. I will probably play this three times. We'll see. Great game, though. Very great game. Definitely fun. Yeah. And so guys, what you have to do is you have to go around literally kill all of these people. Because what's going to happen is eventually you're going to take her I just wanted to do that right quick because I just wanted to make sure I had another picture, guys. Oh, wow. And see how I just took some of their health right there, guys? Oh, wow. And they took some of my health, too. I wish there was a way that you could actually fight. Although the judges found themselves unable to kill a god, despite their best efforts. I don't know, ladies and gentlemen. I feel like uh, this is an interesting ending to the game. I'm already halfway, guys. Um, unfortunately, yes, it got me to go into the Umbral world because I died, but you got to be careful. You got to watch your surroundings because, look, as, as you guys can see right there, they're coming up on me all corners and they're trying to surround me. And it's it ain't pretty, guys. So dodge. Watch out, jump back. Almost got it. Almost got it. Oh man, ladies and gentlemen. For I love all the 
of my children. Wayward ones. But you are my enemy. The loss of the dominion they have established for themselves in my absence. So much guided violence. Now. Wow, what's going on here? Are in the presence of a god human. Your god. You are not my god. I will say that 100% loud and clear, you are not my god, you ugly, disgusting creature looking like Freddy the Krueger with a slash of, I don't even know, bro. Gross. I look upon you with pity, my lost child, for you have been deceived and enslaved by forces who regard you as nothing more than an instrument. they might enact their blasphemous will and prevent my rightful return. Well, that must really suck for you. Well, we just destroyed the god of Lords of the Fallen. Now I'm getting lifted up in the sky and I'm getting... I just got killed myself. Wow. The light of the Umbral Lamp lam knows no satisfaction. Consuming even a god. Okay, that's cool. There it is, ladies and gentlemen. That is Lords of the Fallen. Radiant ending. Shout out to Hexworks and CI Games. Good game right there, guys. I enjoyed it. Debating, should I put the credits in there?
you know, I kind of wish you would have been able to fight that last boss, um, a deer, and actually fought it instead of, you know, you just killing those other people. That was kind of easy. I mean, even though it got me to die and go into the umbral stage, the point is is they should have had a very very tough boss fight for the last boss as always every game has a tough boss maybe they wanted to stand out on this i'm not sure but overall guys rating from me on this game i'm gonna stick it at an 8.5 um for three reasons one is it's not an open world game it was semi open world uh, linear game but I feel like it would have been cooler if it kind of would have had like the Elden Ring concept, you know, major open world, right? That would have been sick. Um, two, some of the, like the skilling in this game, I feel like it is lacking and too strong in a sense I know it's a souls like game and it's supposed to be tough but even at a level high high level the amount of damage done it's kind of weird it's 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 hard to describe but I definitely feel like they could have uh, done a better job on that and then third I'm going to go with um, length of the game. Only reason it took me so long to beat it is because I explored and went over things again and again and again. So those are the three things I feel like they could have done better on this game. Overall, great game. Which one? Oh, snap. One moment. There it is, ladies and gentlemen. I have unlocked the new class. It's called the Radiant Purifier, a material priest of a church of Iranian. Oh, that's a sick thing right there. I like that. That looks dope.
All right, we're going to start the new journey, ladies and gents. Let's go. Have a good one, ladies and gents.